What's good YouTube, welcome back to the channel Caspians, I am back with another video for you guys Thank you guys so much for the continued support, really appreciate it guys If you're new to the channel, you've already been around, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell Share the video with your friends, Casper is holding up so well against the broader market Everything else is bleeding, <laughs> everything else is completely dumping Cash is doing the opposite, just standing strong against the market and you know we've seen it done it for the for its t entire existence and that's why another reason why it should be bullish on cash guys cash right now is sitting at four cent eight nineteen million dollars in market cap 21 million dollars in 24 hour trade volume for cash and um like again like i said guys we were keeping an eye out for these support and resistance levels recently cash came down to that three six cent mark right it hit that support level then it bounced up i thought it was going to continue up from here but it retraced once again back below this uh three nine cent support level but it looks like it broke above it once again after it broke down got back into the range so now it's now uh this range the 39 cent 397 cent level is a uh, support for cash so we'll see if we break out once again from here for cash and continue that uptrend guys let's keep an eye out from shazam cash if you don't like casper don't invest in it widespread fud and hate what's the purpose we all know casper would be leading amongst the other the most gainers in the next bull market you like kda go for it you like cash go for it simple Wiser words never been spoken. PSV to all Casper holders, just have patience. We are the best. Uh, F all the haters. <laughs> they live in. Uh, they live after a bull market in a cardboard box. <laughs> Caspi is forever the best. We see that has three hearts. Shazane's uh, comment has seven hearts. And from QGP, cash so good. Don't buy high and sell low on other alts like KDA Whale did because that will have you chase good projects like cash we've only just begun six hearts for that awesome stuff from the community man from crypto kin the next few days are going to be interesting for cash 0.04 cent is a strong support resistance after a breakout of the compression zone we are now seeing a retest of the 0.04 cent price uh now we have two possibilities cash follows the current market trend and breaks support to consolidate bef between three four cent and four cent or cash decides to not follow the market once again and bounce back to its all-time high of five cent now again that's what i've been uh saying as well that cash has not followed the overall market trends cash is literally a unicorn doing its own thing right there's only a few projects in the space that are you know when the market is retracing correcting dumping whatever you want to call it they actually move to the upside they pump they have positive price action right cas is one of those few projects that is uh doing that so i wouldn't be surprised option two is the possibility we see and we keep going to we continue up to five cent back to the previous all-time high cas my opinion Cas has proven multiple times to not be following the market exactly, so a bouncing retest of the all-time high is probable. Uh, not mentioning the constant increase in hash rate and a possible new exchange listing soon, but I personally will be happy with both options. Understood. It makes sense if, if we consolidate between three cent, four cent. That's a nice way. That's a nice place to scoop up some cas, man. If cas cons consolidates under four cent, I will add more. Let's wait and see. Literally, man cash uh we see the chart right here and we can see uh the two options playing out again like i said we wa we are watching that support line at 39 cent and we'll see what happens we also have the hash rate actually at 14.43 phs now so that hash rate keeps increasing for cash as scanner up up only hash rate continues to impress me but i suspect we are going to see even faster pace with bitmain ks miners coming online 14.46 phs oh my goodness remember guys price usually follows hash rate and if hash rate keeps making new all-time highs i wouldn't be surprised if cash just continues to go on a tier with bitmain uh, asic miners going live right 
uh, from Star McStar. Anytime Cass has a pullback, it becomes the number one bought asset. Probably nothing. Uh, this is uh, from KuCoin. Cass ranks top one in the gem box. That is super amazing news. I'm going to have to title the video of that, man. Anytime Cass drops in price, it does a retrace. It all of a sudden becomes the number one bought asset on KuCoin. Think about that, man. <laughs> People are taking notice and they're scooping Cass because they know how much of a gem this project is. Cass ranks top one in the gem box on KuCoin. Awesome stuff. From CryptoGrad. So he's uh, retweeting from Jim Skibum. Cass versus BTC over the last three months. Really puts it in perspective. Bears happy about a little pullback. Zoom out. Nothing has changed. At one bill market cap, Casper is undervalued. Will be a 10 top 10 coin. CryptoGrad agreed 100. Comparing Cas to BTC in the past few months provides valuable insight. A minor pullback is a buying opportunity at a discount price. And looking at the bigger picture, nothing significant has shifted. Nothing significant has shifted. Just had to read that one more time for you guys. Nothing has changed in CAS as far as the fundamentals, the future developments, what the project is uh, uh, aiming to accomplish. The only thing that happened recently is Bitcoin having its dump, right? So CASPA, first time in a long time, it was affected by the dump of Bitcoin, but we are still showing a lot of strength against Bitcoin and the rest of the market. With a market cap below 1 billion, Casper's potential remains underestimated and undervalued. It's likely to ascend the ranks as a top 10 cryptocurrency soon. And I truly believe that is going to be the case, guys. That is, uh, you know, definitely on my bingo card. <laughs> Space Traveler. In only two weeks, the Casper block reward for miners is reduced by a factor, which is a reduction of 5.6% every month. So the block rewards are also uh, being... Uh, reduced right so that means the supply for cash and the uh, network difficulty is increasing which overall we see it with Bitcoin why does the Bitcoin have and have of such a bullish effect on the Bitcoin price action well because the network difficulty for the miners is uh, has increased they get less block rewards right and then boom we see an explosion in Bitcoin's price same thing here with cash because it's a proof-of-work project Less block rewards for miners means boom, explosion in Casper's price. This time it's, it is from 185 to 174 cast through the chromatic halving schedule. The Casper supply becomes more scarce every month. Chromatic halving. Look at that, man. P chromatic halving schedule. Such bullish technology that was created with this project. From Cinderella, really nice thread about A0 and Cas. I personally hold and love both. I hope be, they'll be doing very well in the future. Great tech on both of them and insane potential. Let's see from Gonzo XBT. Uh, Casper versus Aleph Zero, revolutionizing Layer 1 networks for scalability. Today I'm going to present two of the hottest Layer 1 projects for the next bull run. What's Cas all about is A0 better than Cas tokenomics of both, my opinion. We got a little video here as well. A0 versus Casper, nice. Uh, the Bitcoin network's congestion crisis happened in May with 390,000 unconfirmed transactions led people to search for alternative transaction fees have surged as a result of the network's limitations. One of the prominent factors contributing to the con uh, congestion is the influx of ordinal inscriptions and BRC20 tokens overwhelming the blockchain's capabilities. This is something I spoke about in my live streams that created congestion on the Bitcoin network and also increased the transaction costs. So we already see Bitcoin as a layer one, you know, getting congested so easily is not can't cut it compared to Casper, man. Currently, two popular layer ones are trying to address the network congestion issues of uh, Bitcoin. Casper emerges a solid alternative to the issues that played the Bitcoin network. Casper is not just a cryptocurrency. It is a blazing fast decentralized proof of work network designed to overcome the scalability and congestion of bottlenecks of BTC. Right. Awesome stuff. Casper speed is nothing short of impressive. <laughs> impressive. That is, uh, you know, speaking lightly, man. <laughs> when, I, when I sent Cas, you know, whenever I sent Cas or did some tests myself, I was like, yo, 
This is so fast, man. This is so quick, instantly. With a remarkable block time of just one second, it processes an astounding 60 blocks per minute, 3600 blocks per hour, and an astonishing 86400 blocks per day. Its native currency cast is the lifeblood of the project, facilitating all on-chain transactions and mining reward distribution. Importantly, cast is a true L1 coin, not just a token. The driving force behind cast is Jonathan Sampolinski and Visionary, who co-authored the Ghost Dad Protocol, the backbone of Casper's consensus mechanism. Positions as the fastest and most scalable instant confirmation transaction layer ever built on proof of work engine, Casper stands as a testament to innovation in the blockchain space. What sets Cas apart? One word: Block Dag. Block Dag is a structure where blocks are represented as vertices connected by edges, symbolizing references to predecessors. Originally crafted to tackle blockchain's orphan problem, it's a game changer in scalability. You guys see the infinite scaling potential with Block Dag. Blockchain faces hurdles like processing speed, RAM, and more, yet the orphan rate stands out as a protective layer ba level barrier. Orphans, orphans occur when na network delays make some blocks miss the longest chain. So instead of uh, the orphan blocks being not used with Block Dag, you uh, make use of the orphan blocks, right? Orphan blocks are that are created at the same time as another block, but it's not accepted as part of the blockchain. You see that? So the blockchain is typically just straightforward, and then they have the orphan blocks that don't get accepted. So with block DAG, they make use of the orphan block, orphan blocks to help increase that scalability, right? Orphan versus security. More orphans e equals less security. High orphan rate weakens chain security due to frequent forks. Security chance isn't smooth if Onyx blocks get sidelined out of the side of the main chain. Block DAG embeds the fork idea in its core, built on Bitcoin's proof of work. A small tweak allows blocks to reference multiple predecessors, so a block DAG naturally expands as blocks link to various tips. Protocols like Spectre and Phantom, based on block DAG, tackle orphan related woes. The perks are impressive. Lightning fast confirmations, I'm telling you, uh, sky high transaction capacity, mining decentralization boost, I'm telling you, I'm telling you guys, fewer pool temptations, lower fees, speed, like it's uncomparable. Casper tokenomics, 28 billion total, market cap a bit, just under a billion. Casper's future shines bright with the upcoming integration of DAG Knight, which I've spoken about. This protocol upgrade aims to enhance network capabilities. It'll make Casper the first parameterless cryptocurrency. This means network will self-adapt based on its health and latency conditions, ensuring optimal performance. Now that we have talked about Cas, let's talk about another project self-solving the same issue. So this is A0, okay. So this is Casper versus A0 now. So we see how Casper shines with his technology, how it like stands out and is so unique, and this is why people this is why the price action is showing right so let's take a look at a0 now a0 or uh lf0 thrives as a centralized privacy focused blockchain that are uh, designed to elevate web 3.0 activities it removes central control ensuring censorship free payments and participation a0 pioneers a fresh consensus meta named proof of stake with secret sharing poss knows engage in consensus without revealing their identities or transactional details now this is the thing with proof of stake security becomes a big issue but i could see they have a little bit of scale in here but proof of stake to me you know has so much security issues guys so uh i'm not personally bullish on proof of stake layer ones anymore i'll be honest with you man I, i'm not super bullish on them as much anymore ethereum's record high congestion has resulted in exorbitant fees impacting regular users who pay more for transactions tell me about it lf0 emerges as a beacon of scalability and privacy okay a0 has super scalability mentioned a whopping 100,000 transactions every second and a confirmation time of 4 16 milliseconds it is one of the highest whole cryptocurrency market currently okay interesting also it's it is the fastest as far as uh, other proof of stake projects go because much majority of these projects here are proof of stake right but again this is why i like casper so much because it stays true to the proof of work uh the proof of work technology that bitcoin adheres to but it also has the speed and scalability and that's why 
you know it won't fall into the trap of similar to like the sec calling a lot of these projects here cardano etc recently got called securities by the sec and alf zero could fall into that trap being a proof of stake project by integrating elements from parity substrate stack a, a zero operates a public blockchain with unique directed acyclic graph structure okay so it does use dag as well supports a secure multi party compa computation concepts promoting security and privacy the network also in integrates cloud computing enhancing its decentralized file storage system interesting it helps devs through oracles and api hooks promoting flexibility and advanced DeFi functions privacy remains paramount in the digital age a zero's approach safeguards against online threats through uh privacy as first line of defense well if a zero you know is aiming more to privacy it could be a monero competitor you know take monero out of its spot <laughs> by not requiring personal information like banks a zero ensures data remains secure uh also talking about how hackers stole two billion dollars worth of uh you know crypto recently a zero helps to protect against that my opinion cast and a zero are leaders in the mission to transform l1 networks casper's lightning fast transaction powered by ghost dag and the upcoming data night integration solve congestion and scalability hurdles on the other hand a zero introduces privacy focused blockchain technology and a new consensus mechanism reducing gas fees and ensuring secure transactions both projects have the same spirit of the progress in the market which where innovation is the key depending on priorities one might favor uh might have a favorite among them regardless of the choice the two networks mark a new chapter in the evolution of layer one solutions no hate and disrespect to a zero and the project i see people are bullish on it but you know sticking to the true mo uh true uh you know essence of what bitcoin represents cas holds true to that essence right and this is why you see Bitcoin investors and Bitcoin miners, etc. Even mining, right? These are only achievable through proof of work, right? And after Ethereum changed from proof of work to proof of stake, I think we need a, a top, you know, a top proof of work project that has that solves what Bitcoin solves, uh, solves the issues that Bitcoin has. And that's why I'm personally more bullish on Cass uh, because of that whole uh, essence of what crypto was founded on, right? Proof of work, right? So, Caspians, and if uh, any A0 watchers are tuning in, <laughs> let me get your thoughts down below. Uh, so it's for... Um, that's pretty much it for the video thank you guys so, thank you guys so much for tuning in please be sure to like comment subscribe hit that notification bell share the video with your friends and family become a channel member i appreciate all the support guys and i'll catch you in the next one